In this video I will show you how you can create a TikTok effect inside DaVinci Resolve. Right now on my timeline I am having a video footage which is a podcast on YouTube. And first what you can do is you can go into your media pool, right click on your timeline, then go to timeline settings and you can set your resolution to 1080 to 1920 to make it vertical. Next up you want to go to effects and you can search for adjustment clip. Then you can drag it and leave it over your footages. Make sure that it's staying on the top. You can stretch it out until it fits the full length of your video. Next, you want to highlight your adjustment clip that you have just placed it and you can go to the fusion page. Then you can zoom in into your screen footage so you can have a better preview of what you're implementing. Then you can highlight your media in and press control space so you can open the effects menu. And then you can add an unsharp mask. You can click on add and then we add it in between. What you want to do with this unsharp mask is that you want to increase the size, not by too much, you can just experiment with it. I'm leaving mine to around 2.4 and also I'm going to increase the size of gain and I'm going to leave it also on around 2.4. And this is going to make your video a little bit sharper, so it's going to pop a little bit more. It may also look a tiny bit over the top, but that's all the effect about. After setting up the values of your liking, you can preview the video, see how it's going and if you like it, you can continue with the next step. You can highlight this unsharp mask, press control space again to open the effects menu and there you can type color correction. You want to add that color correction and in there you just want to touch just a tiny bit of the saturation, not too much. I'm leaving mine on something like 1.1. After setting up our color correction, there's just one more note that we need to add, pressing control space again, and then we are looking for camera shake, like this one, click on add, highlight this camera shake, and you can see that it's over the top. So you want to go to the inspector and you can reduce the overall strength almost to zero, I'm leaving mine on 0.015, and also I'm going to reduce the speed almost to zero, just like the strength, on a values of approximately 0.03. Of course you can preview your footage and see if it's gonna fit your liking. If that was the case, you can go to the effects tab and add the final touches. Right now I'm previewing and I hear that there are two people that are speaking. So the next step is to switch the camera position. So I highlight this adjustment clip and I increase the size until it fits the whole screen. Then I'm gonna make a razor cut over my footage so that I can separate two sections in the adjustment clip. I'm listening where the second person is start talking and I'm making a cut right there. So in my case that's right here. So I'm pressing Ctrl B to make a razor cut. So my second segment of the video is ready. Then I highlight the first one and I'm adjusting the position X so that it can fit the first person. And this is the final result. Also don't forget to check this video out here. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.